All right, y'all boys asked for a tutorial on how to do the macro and I'm the Gabriel one. For the dude, I said I was on. I don't got nothing to lie for. This will get you at least 100 mil an hour. I personally got almost 200 mil, or I probably did get 200 mil in an hour or under an hour, depending on your Wi Fi and your graphics and stuff. But, all right, here we go. So, y'all boys gonna want first things first. Y'all gonna want to get auto style keyboard pressure, tiny task. And uh, hopefully, I'll click. I'm gonna leave the download file of these in the description. So, once y'all get that, it should look something like this. Now, I'm gonna teach y'all. I'm gonna break everything down and I'm gonna teach y'all how to do it. It's gonna really be complicated. It's not. So, for the keyboard pressure, y'all gonna wanna set your hotkey to F3. I set mine to F3. And I set the keyboard pressure to F2 because they're close together and you can just click them at the same time for when you start your macro. Uh, yeah, setting it to 100 milliseconds is fine. With the keyboard pressure, uh, you want to set it to uh, about 100 milliseconds too. But once you download auto clicker, all you got to do is change this to 100 milliseconds. Make sure it's on repeat until stop so it keeps on going. And then make sure your mouse button is left single. It's going it's gonna to be just by default anyway. And then Boom, go to hockey setting, changes to F3. That's about it for the auto click. For the auto keyboard pressing. Boom. All y'all wanna do is start 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 stop hockey. You wanna set that to F1. And to play to play back hockey, you wanna set that F2. Now when you press F1. When you press F1 gonna start recording. Now when it says start pressing and run, when it says press, press the key where wherever the injector is, press that. So boom. Now if I press F2, it's gonna play it. Just like that. Now once y'all set that up, y'all y'all go on to implement this the time test. So, make sure y'all got the blood quest. Oh, yeah. You feel me? Go to this dude right here. Go ahead and get you your quest. All right, once you do all that, that's out the way. I'm going to actually go ahead and give y'all an example of how I do it. So, I fly to about, to about this dude's head. I zoom out. Get all of these dudes. Gather all of them on me. So it's on the car. And now start hitting them with the syringe. You see how it, how it goes up so fast? Quest completed in a few seconds. Repeat quest. Boom. Now you see how every time I complete the quest, you gotta re equip the syringe. And you gotta repeat the quest at the same time. That's where the macro comes in. All right. So you see how every time I complete the quest, the syringe goes back to number one. So what I would do is I would set up my 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 keyboard presser. So press F one, start recording. All right, stop pressing. Stop it by pressing F1 again. Now if I press F2, it'll play it back. Now if I press F3, like how I set up my, my auto clicker, if I press F3, it's gonna make it so that you click this over and over again. Now if I press both at the same time, Does that so now I'm hitting them while equipping and re equipping the syringe over and over again? That's gonna be helpful for the macro. Now to set up the macro, tiny task to set up your tiny task, just go to go to press right here. Perfect. Uh, make sure you got continuous playback on playback speed at one. I put my playback hotkey. Control shift alt P. My recording to control shift 
R. If y'all are using those settings, my exact settings, make sure y'all got shift lock off. Because if you try to record, if it's a, it's just gonna mess up the macro. So make sure y'all got your shift lock off. Boom. So what y'all got all these settings? Yeah, all y'all gotta do is record using Control Shift R R, and I'm gonna teach y'all how to record. So. This where I'm gonna set up the macro right here. All right. So, let's see, it's gonna be recording. Now press whatever key you set it as. I can set mine to Control Shift R R. Just start recording it. No shit, wrong thing. So let's see what if I do Control Shift R R. Record it. If I do it again, it stops recording. So, what you want to do is make sure you got time or any other grimoire that got a projector like this so that you can hit all the golems. If you try to do it with the bow, it's not going to work as well. Oh, actually, it might. Oh, shit, it do work. Okay, I'm lying. Just make sure you at least like an inch above his head so that you can hit him with the, with the syringe. So, I'm gonna get him off me. Get him off me, get him off me. Now this is how you set up the macro. Go about a little bit above the new head, the colon head. Get your get your projectiles or your bow. Now, you wanna leave everything like this before you start recording. Now I'm gonna start recording. In three, two, one. Actually, hold on. So when I start recording, just copy everything I do. And I'll explain what everything does. Three, two, one. All right, I'm recording. Equip your projectile. Click a few times to make sure that it's there. Now I hit all four of the golems. Get them on you. Now what you want to do is press your F2 and F3. Remember when you set up your hockey? Now, cover your mouse over the repeat quest. So basically what I just did is I basically, I just quit my projectile, make sure, cause sometimes like it'll go off screen and it'll mess up your macro. So make sure you hit the ground a few times before you hit the golems. And then you hit all the golems guiding them on you. And then you use your setup, um, the auto key clicker. You set up, you, you press the key bind at the same time. The auto clicker can press uh, key bind and the auto clicker key bind. And then it'll look something like this. Now look how my money goes up so fast. Y'all thought I was lying. No, y'all can make over a hundred million an hour doing this. My money goes up fast and my stars go up fast. I don't know what the hell they're gonna do with the stars, but they're gonna do something with it. So we're going. It's going, it's going, it's going. Uh, eventually, when they when they do die eventually, you're gonna you're gonna to wanna to keep it going for a little bit just as a fail safe. So if you know, it'll, it'll just keep going overnight, it'll keep going overnight. As long as you record it just like I'm doing right here. Everything should be going cool. for this first year, I don't gotta wait. No, I'm gonna make y'all wait. Y'all can just fast forward y'all damn stuff. So boom, my money's going up, my money's going up, I'm killing them.
hurts and all. Eventually they'll all die. Boom, the dead. Just keep it going for a few seconds. Wait till all of them respawn again. Boom. Now just keep hitting them for a few seconds, keep hitting them for a few seconds. This is just a spell save, just in case your macro messes up during it. So that it will keep going, it won't, it won't stop. Now press those same keys, that F2 and that F3, the auto keyboard presser and the auto clicker, to stop it. Boom, stop it. Stop everything. Now, what you want to do is, unequip your syringe. Stop recording, and that's it. That's your macro set up. Now, make sure it is on continuous playback, or else you have to repeat everything you just fucking did. And then you do Control Shift Alt P to record it, and then boom, everything starts over again. And you just do it overnight. Look, I got seven mil, and, and probably a minute. Probably a minute or two. That shit is crazy. If I can get seven, if I'm getting seven mil in like a minute or two, then shit, that's proof. Seven mil in a minute, seventy mil in ten minutes. Shit, you might even be able to make more with this marker if you set it up faster. I was just going slow so I could show you how the process, but look. Now you just keep this playing overnight. And you're gonna make a cool, smooth few hundred million, probably a billion, depending on how long, how long you leave it on over that. Maybe over a billion. Who knows? And you're getting free stars too. So, that's basically how you set everything up. And yeah, you just keep this running. And you can also grind mastery with this too, because of the XP you get from the quest. And you finish in the quest in that in a few seconds. Got down two or three seconds you finish in each quest, so your XP gonna go up hella. Whatever whatever grimoire you got, if you need mastery for it, this is this is the method right here. Well yeah, that's about it. If y'all got if y'all got any questions, ask me in the Discord, ask me in the comments. I'm gonna leave all all the downloads and shit in the uh in the description. I'm gonna leave all the links in there. Uh, yeah, that's about it. All right, y'all.